So coming into university, I knew research was something I wanted to pursue. In high school, I really enjoyed reading research papers and I was a research assistant um, before first year, um, which I really enjoyed. So I knew I wanted to pursue research in some capacity in university, even though I actually don't have any science fair experience from high school. So coming into first year, it was kind of daunting because I wasn't really sure how I could get involved in research um, because I didn't have much experience, but I found that there were actually um, quite a few opportunities to get involved and also everyone starts um, without experience. So when I came to UBC and was looking for opportunities, um, something that stood out was the research experience program that the Undergraduate Research Opportunities Club at UBC runs. And in this program, they basically um, pair people with mentors so they can work on a project and present at Merck, which is the multidisciplinary undergraduate research conference. <laughs> So I've been in this program for the past few months and I've really been enjoying it so far. So the project that I've been working on is about bioethics, um, which isn't really related to engineering, but it was something I was um, personally interested in. And um, right now I'm just reading a bunch of papers because we're doing a literature review. Um, and I really enjoyed it because the mentor that our group has is really supportive and knowledgeable and our group has five members total. So it was also a great opportunity to meet new people. So the other opportunity I got involved with was joining a design team. So I joined um, the biomedical engineering student team, which um, is also called BEST. And on the team, I joined um, MINT, which um, stands for Medical Innovation in Neurotechnology. Um, and basically this team is building an EEG, which is an electroencephalogram <laughs> for the Neurotech X comp competition. And this is more of the engineering side of research, I guess. Um, it's not really research in a way because it's not like you're writing a paper or writing an experiment, but you get to um, learn um, kind of like the skills for research, like coding or um, signal processing, um, designing materials and running tests. So for me, it's been a really, really good experience. So a few weeks ago, I went to the um, Get Into Research panel that um, Epsi Professional Development was running, and I heard about some different research opportunities there, which I'll tell you about now, but um, I haven't been involved in any of these opportunities. So the first opportunity they told us about was applying for work-learn positions, which are basically part-time positions um, to be research assistants. UBC Engineering also has a co-op program, and I've heard of a lot of people doing research positions as their co-op. So thank you so much for watching my video. Um, as always, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you. Bye!